Good morning. This is Pastor John from the branch, trying to stay warm, <laughs> bringing you a Monday motivation. That's what we want to do. You know, God's word is so powerful, and I love the comfort that comes from it. Uh, there's a verse that I was reading, though, that can be kind of troubling if you don't really understand it. Um, I want to share that with you from Matthew chapter 5, verse 20. For I tell you, unless your lives are more pure and full of integrity than the religious scholars and the Pharisees, you'll never experience the realm of heaven's kingdom. I learned that verse uh, with this translation. Unless your righteousness surpasses that of the Pharisees, you will never inherit the kingdom of God. Can you imagine what the people thought when they heard Jesus say these words? The Pharisees were like the church people. They were like uh, obeying all these laws and the people might have been thinking, I could never ever keep up with how they live. Maybe there's people out there that think the same thing about people that go to church. I'm not holy like them. I'm not blameless like them. Who do you think of as being great? I know like on a day like today, Martin Luther King Jr. Maybe you think of how people like uh, Mother Teresa. You think of certain people in your lives. Maybe it's something as simple as your grandmother. You know, she was holy. And you don't look at yourself like that. And now you read this verse that says, unless you are pure and your integrity in uh, surpasses that of, you fill in the blank. You're not going to ever inherit the kingdom of heaven. What is Jesus saying here? There's only one righteousness, there's only one goodness that surpasses all of these great people. And that's Jesus. And guess what? You believe in him, God the Father looks at you through his eyes. I love it. We don't have to be good enough. Heaven is ours because it's God's free gift to us. So unless your righteousness surpasses that of whoever, you fill in the blank, whoever you think is great and perfect and holy and pure, if it's not greater than that, you're not going to inherit the kingdom of heaven. But Jesus' righteousness is. His goodness is. His integrity is. His pureness is. And he gives it all to you when you believe in what he did for you on the cross and how he rose victorious. I love it because the question always comes up, how good do you got to be to get to heaven? If there's a standard, if there's an instruction on that, we'll always say, was that good enough? Was I pure enough? But if the question, if the answer is, you can never be good enough, John, I take great comfort in that because Jesus is good enough. And he gives me his goodness. The same is true for you. That motivates me to serve him, to love him, and to tell others that he is the way to eternal life. And he gives you his goodness and his mercy. And that is greater than anything. This is Pastor John from the Branch. I hope you have a great day.